We know winter can be brutal on our skin, and today we're focusing on great skincare routines for men to help keep your skin hydrated, healthy, and free of itches during these cold months. Danielle Whittaker is with us now, the owner of Salon To Go Medical Spa. Good morning, Danielle. Thanks for being with us. Good morning. Thanks for having me. How are you? I, I am good. My knuckles are, are <laughs> hurting a little bit. I was telling you, I'm, I'm the worst at this. I, I know I need to do a better job. But for, first off, before we get into this, uh, can you tell us about your spa and where you're located? Yeah, so we're actually located in West Bloomfield. Um, we do facials, um, obviously, for like hydration. We do chemical peels. We do IV therapy. Um, so, yep, we are in uh, West Bloomfield, Michigan. And, and maybe before I ask you some more questions, too, you can talk about what, what your uh, partner is demonstrating this morning. Yeah, so this is my nurse. She's actually applying a hydration mask. So um, in these Michigan winter months, obviously our skin can get very dry, itchy and irritated. So one thing that you always wanna do is just make sure that you are always using hydration. So even for your moisturizers, in the winter, you wanna make sure that you're using something that's a little bit more thick, a cream based with no alcohol in it. So that way, you know, you don't wanna make the drying and the irritation worse. So how often do you recommend getting that done? Every four weeks is the best route to keeping your skin hydrated and energized. Um, also, for all of our facials that we do, we offer to add on IV therapy because um, in this bag, there's a thousand milliliters of hydration. So people can add on um, vitamins into their bags, such as biotin, which is great for hair, skin, and nails. And let's talk a little bit too about, you know, your, your hands too, and just, just skincare in general, other, other than the face. Mm -hmm. You know, sometimes you put on lotion, at least I put on lotion. I just feel like it doesn't do anything. Do you have any recommendations or, or types of lotions yeah, that you should use so, for chapped hands? Absolutely. So um, lotions tend, they're great in the summer, you know, during the summer, fall, spring, lotion is great. But when you're getting into the winter months, um, and you're getting the dryness, the crack hands, you wanna go to something thicker, such as like a bag bomb. Cetaphil's really good. Something that has intensive recovery, even, you know, written right on it. Normally the alcohol content is lower in it and it will have more like green tea, which is great for hydration and energizing skin too. So just go to a thicker balm, anything intensive recovery, um, or, you know, that is strictly for hydration. Do you know, I mean, sometimes on labels too, when you're out, you're picking up or buying some lotion, the labels, are, they'll try to check you with some marketing. Are there something like, should we be looking out for something that might be on the labels that we know would work best or things to avoid? Um, so anything um, hyaluronic acid, if you see that in there, like the word hyaluronic acid, it is great for the skin because it actually draws and holds water, which is the problem that we're having when our skin is getting dry. So look for hyaluronic acid, look for collagen base, intensive recovery cream. Um, those are the ones that are gonna be great for you know rehydrating and energizing the skin. And I think we probably need it more than ever the last two years, especially with everybody using more and more hand sanitizer, then, uh, then you especially need to take care of your skin. Um, tell us a little Absolutely. bit more about the, the, the process um, that you're demonstrating in front of us too. I mean, how long does this normally take? Should we should do it like every four weeks and, and how long should a visit take? So the masking, you know, you can actually do even daily, you know, you could do it once a night. Masking is great for your skin any time of the day. But as far as doing your facials, um, every four weeks, and a mask will be included in your hydration facial. So um, like I said, the facials every four weeks, and you wanna stay away from the chemical peels just at this time. They're great you know, during other months, but when your skin's very dry, you wanna stay away from the retinol. So um, I would just recommend hydration facial or even a hydrofacial, which is this machine back here that you see. This is great for infusing antioxidants and also doing extractions and comes with LED light therapy also. All right, Daniel Whittaker with Salon To Go Medical Spa. Thank you so much for being with us this morning. Men, you gotta pay attention. I know I look <laughs> like people are like, did you get in a fist fight? And I'm like, no, I just need to take better care of my hands when I'm putting you know, lotion Stay on Stay away from those stuff. bar soaps. <laughs> yes, all right. Well, great yeah. advice, Daniel. Thank you so much and, and have a great day. Thank you.